Hey guys, what is up? Shaber1000 here. Today we're going to do a little vlogging, kind of. It's going to be a vlog, but we're going to be talking about some cameras. And I'm going to vlog with three of my old cameras. And I have them set up here. And we're going to see if we can tell the difference in them. Okay, so we have got... We've got this JVC right here. We have got this JVC right here. And we have a Panasonic over here. So... So what I'm going to do is, they'll shut off after a minute, that's pretty cool. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get these aimed all in the right direction. We're going to start with that JVC right there. And I'll tell you which one that I'm recording with. And I'll also put a caption below so you'll know which one is being used. And this is cool, this is that, uh, that head that I bought at that um, estate sale and I screwed it on to this Vivitar um, tripod screwed right on there so and that's a good head does all different kinds of stuff so anyway back to what we were talking about we're gonna do we're gonna start with that one we're gonna go to this one and then to the Panasonic and these are all old I don't know what year these are um, if I can look it up, I will. If I can find the dates about what year they are, I will um, leave them in the captions. So, let's get started on this, guys. Okay, guys. This is the JVC number one, which I've got these wrote down because I have no idea. It, I'll forget them because I don't use them all the time. But... It's the GR-AXM210, okay? Like I said, if I can think of the years, I'll put them down below or in the description, or if I can find the, what year they are, I don't know. So, but, so that's what that one is. Now, I've got, I've got all these at flea markets, every one of these. Um... I can remember which two I got. I, I can't remember. I know I bought. I bought two at two different places. Uh, one one guy he wanted. I forget what it was. Uh, Twelve bucks for both of them and the bags. And I said, look, I'm not interested in them. I said, I'll give you five bucks for both of them and the bags, everything, whole nine yards. And he says, no, I can't do that. So, I said, okay, well, thanks for your time. Thanks for showing them to me. And I started doing the walk away. And he says, now, wait a minute. No, you know, maybe maybe we can work out a deal. How about seven? I said, I'm sticking at five. I don't even know if they work. He says, I'll guarantee you they work. You know, I've heard that before. I said, no. I said, I'll give you five bucks. So, he him hawed around there for a minute. And I started walking away again. He said, all right, they're yours. Okay guys, JVC number two. This is the GR-SXM340. Yes. GR-SXM340. Of course, all these are, are tapes. None of these are high definition, but all three of these do have um, image stabilization on them. Uh, this one has a mic or a light. The Panasonic has a light that JVC does not. I have another, I believe it's a Panasonic or another uh, JVC similar to that one over there. Um, it's, it's got issues. I'm not sure what's wrong with it. It'll work sometimes. Sometimes it doesn't. But it also has a light on it. But, uh, but yeah, all through these image sta stabilization, and they are old, and they're working. I mean, they're working fine. I'm recording with them right now. So I like to get them out. I've mentioned this before in a couple of my videos. I like to get them out and uh, use them once in a while. And, you know, that's, that's I didn't get them just to look at. Well, kind of, I did. But I also like all my stuff to work. So um, all the 
cameras we have work except for the one I was just telling you about it does have issues um, I'm not sure what's going on with it I'm pretty sure I can repair it if not it's a great parts uh, camera so there's that number two okay guys this is the Panasonic it is a PV dash L452 D that's the one we're using there now the other camera I was just talking about on that camera uh, the one that has issues is this one here it is also a JVC it's identical to the first one we used except for this one has a light on it now it has some issues I'm not sure what's going on with it it kicks on and everything uh, you, you can't see anything through the screen or th through the viewfinder um, it's just blank it lights up but it's just blank and when you shut it off it doesn't shut off now it worked fine when I got it so I don't know what happened to it this is the GR-SXM320 so it's kind of like the predecessor to the uh, second JVC which is the SXM340 so so it's one step below the 340 the second camera we did and one step above it's in between the first JVC and the second JVC I would like to fix this one because this one did work really well um, I may have dropped it that wasn't there before Can you see that that little nick right there was not there before so now of course none of these cameras have they're not full high def they're not at all so if you just upload them straight onto YouTube you're gonna have the black bars on the sides so when I use these what I usually do is go to one of my editors and I'll put it in 16.9 and I'll crop it if I have to to make a full screen it also, if you, when you do that, it does blow it up a little bit, but I, I don't like the black bars on the sides. So, that's, that's what I'll do with these. It does give it a little better look, and I can uh, upgrade it to uh, almost like a 1080p. I mean, you're still only going to get what this puts out, but I can make it, I can enhance it through saving it, um, processing it in uh, 1080p. So this is what I did for you guys today. So this, you know, I just want to do something different. Um, Monkey should be home here shortly. Uh, she didn't have too many patients today. Uh, I was going to go with her, but I went back to sleep. She had one here in town, and she's going to come back and pick me up. And I went back to sleep, so I didn't know if she came back and just didn't want to bother me. Sometimes she does that. She don't like to bother me if I'm sleeping because I don't sleep that much but anyway that's another story so there's there's the three of them the first one again was the GR AXM 210 the second one it was JVC the second one was GR uh, SXM 340 and the Panasonic which we are looking at right now is the PV-L452D and the camera I'm using right now our good one is the Sony it is the CX240 and I want to upgrade to the Sony 675 700 area uh, I think I think that'll be my next camera they're pretty pricey um, but you can buy them new for around 500 uh, right in there ish but I'm used for around 300 so I think that'll be my next camera I'll give this one to monkey monkey really likes this camera so all right guys okay guys this is the one I'm having issues with the uh, JVC GR dash SXM 320 it's kind of between that one and that one that one's a little bigger that one's a smaller or whatever you know the number wise um, I, I, I got it plugged in here and I'll kind of show you what's going on here okay there's this one and I also liked it because it has auto light like the Panasonic the other JVC with the, with the light um, has 
it, 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 it doesn't have auto light I don't believe but let's turn this on here and as you can see the light is on this is this is what we got see what happened okay this is what we got um, the lens is closed and the lens cover is open see so I don't know <laughs> what's going on here but as you can see that's what it does um, I don't know I don't know what's going on with it you know you can turn the brightness up and down on it but there's no picture I would love to know why why that doesn't work um, the light works see the light comes on everything works except for that I don't know if the lens but you know I don't know I'll just have to see what's going on with that and the same way if you close the cover and look down in there see the same thing it uh, you know it doesn't do anything so but sometimes you plug it in or put a battery in it and it'll work right off the bat so I don't I don't know this one also has a has a stabilizer on it uh, I mean that's a little dirty in there I don't know if you can see that but these aren't hard to take apart and clean them I had to do uh, that one there and this one here um, so I, I don't know I really don't know what's going on with it um, but then we'll shut it off here See, and it doesn't shut off. It's on power off right there, but it's still on. I mean, I, I don't, the light don't come on or nothing, but that light is still on, and that, that light used to go out. That's a, that's a standby light, so I don't know. I, I, I like this camera. I mean, I, I thought this one worked probably the best, but it looks like I may have dropped it, you know, and, uh, something came loose in there I don't know either I dropped it or monkey dropped it but I remember that was not there so hi right, guys there you go just vlogging messing around with my cameras I like to do that once in a while again because um, you know to me they're nostalgic you're not going to you know pretty soon you're not going to see these anymore. You can still buy tapes for them, but you don't hardly ever see somebody with this big of a camera <laughs> walking around. You know what I mean? So, all right, guys. There you go. Uh, okay, vlog's not quite over yet. <laughs> I'm vlogging. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um, so, <laughs> monkey sometimes... <laughs> Uh, comes home with stuff in the back of the truck. <laughs> really? Can you guys see what that says? You got a free bicycle. Okay, let's check. This will be a. This will be a. I think it's brand new almost. Hyper. It? It's a hyper. That's a pretty decent bicycle. Yeah, I got it in a very good at a good neighborhood. Oh, Shimano drive. equipped. <laughs> Guys, I don't know a lot about bicycles because when I was growing up, it was Schwinn, and if you had a Huffy, you were kicking ass, right? Yeah. But I do know a lot of my friends was always getting the Shimano stuff. So this is Shimano equipped. See, it's got Shimano there. All right, cool. So we're going to do back tires holding there. Think, front tires holding there I think they just couldn't ride it or they fell off and got upset or something <laughs> wow because it's in a gated community where I found it older 55 and over yeah so I'm thinking it was an older person that just couldn't ride it anymore maybe and he had it at the end of his driveway near my patient's house and it said free I turned around and went and got it <laughs> you my girl <laughs> all right guys we'll say bye bye <laughs> Alright guys, so stay tuned for another video on this.
we will do a review on this bicycle so and I'll uh, I'll do my homework on it and we'll see see about it and uh, see what they go for and everything like that so thanks for watching again guys we'll see you soon bye bye